someone's life. <laughs> um, we're here today to celebrate Arbor Day, the Georgia Arbor Day, but there's also a National Arbor Day. The first Arbor Day was held on April the 10th, 1872 in Nebraska City, started by Julius Morton. Morton was convinced everyone that, that day that they should reflect the appreciation of all trees and Arbor Day was born that day and over a million trees were planted in Nebraska. From this humble beginning, <laughs> this event is now nationally recognized and celebrated on the last Friday in April. The state of Georgia celebrates the Arbor Day on the third Friday in February in order to ensure that all the trees that are planted will be in the best environment for them to thrive. I've got a question for y'all then. Does anybody here know what the state tree of Georgia is? Anybody know what the state tree of Georgia is? The state tree of Georgia is the live oak. Um, the other thing is that the city of Dalton has now been recognized as a tree city USA for over 31 years. We're in the top 15 cities in the state of Georgia for recognition of tree city. And today we're going to be planting a forest pansy redbud. I think these are the ones in the front right here, right? And then the uh, economy cherry tree. And then finally, I'd like to recognize the Dalton Public Sports Department and the leadership of Jerome Key, our city arborist, in maintaining and replacing the wonderful tree step that Dalton enjoys. I'd also like to thank Mayor Pennington for joining us today, too. I'll now turn it over to Will. Good morning, everybody. I, I went around and talked to you yesterday and asked you to please wear your coats today, and you did. So thank you for that. I'm sure you're appreciating that you're a little bit warmer than you might normally be. So I'm glad that you came out in your coats. On behalf of Park Creek students and staff, I want to welcome you to our school, and thank you for helping us celebrate Georgia Arbor Day. Today we're planting these trees that will provide beauty and shade for years to come. Mayor Pennington, Superintendent Scott, Chief Academic Officer Laura Orr, uh, City Arborist Jerome Key, and esteemed me members of the Dalton Tree Board, thank you for what you do to help our community move forward every day. Also, Mr. Chris Hester, where are you Mr. Hester? There he is, Mr. Chris Hester. Thank you for being a bit of a local hero by working to decrease pollution from stormwater runoff into our creeks and tributaries. It is because of your work and people like you that we have our tri-spot daughter swimming near our school. To all, again, thank you. Mr. Purvis, I'll turn it over to you. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. One of the beautiful parts about being an old person on the tree board is that they don't, you don't have to shovel. I don't have to help plan these things. They let me do the heavy work like reading the poem. <laughs> so this is a poem written by a fellow named Joyce Kilman. And he has he has, he is instrumental in a, in a nice little forest park just inside of the, the North Carolina boundary where there's some beautiful old trees up there. It's a good day to run up there if you want to take it up and drive something down. So I'm going to share with you his poem called Trees. I think that I should, shall never see a poem as lovely as a tree. A tree whose hungry mouth is pressed against the earth's sweet glowing breast. A tree that looks to die all day and which shall be the arms of prey. A tree that may in summer wear Yes, the drop is just kind of air. Upon whose bosom the snow has lain, who intimately lives with rain. Poems are made by fools like me, but only God can take the shape. Thank you. Thank you, Pete. <laughs> Mayor Pennington, we appreciate you being here. Would you please come up and offer your words? Thank you. I'm going to have to do this quickly before my glasses fog up again and I can't read this proclamation. This is Georgia Arbor Day, February 19, 2021. 
whereas the first Arbor Day was celebrated in 1872 in Nebraska as a special day for planting trees, it has grown to thousands of celebrations in communities across our nation each year, whereas community partners, families, and friends have joined together in local Arbor Day cer ceremonies to recognize the benefits of trees in urban parks, whereas trees improve air and water quality, reduce the erosion of precious stops of soil, increase property values, economic vitality in business areas, cut heating and cooling costs, and moderate the temperature, provide shade and habitat for wildlife, and add beauty to communities. Whereas trees promote outdoor recreation, which improves human health and well-being, and are a source of renewal and enhance the aesthetic quality of life. Now, therefore, be it resolved, I, David Pennington, Mayor of the City of Dalton, Georgia, hereby proclaim February 19, 2021, the Georgia Arbor Day, and encourage our citizens to plant trees, thus living, leaving a legacy for present and future generations. Thank all y'all for what y'all do. Okay, boys and girls, this to me is the, the fun part. You see we have these boards here. If you would like, what we're gonna do is we're going to come as a class, the class will walk along the boards. You can pick up a handful of dirt, drop it in the hole to help plant the tree. Did you guys hear me over here? You can pick up a handful of dirt, drop it in the hole to help plant the tree, okay? There are a couple things that I want to make sure that we know. We don't throw the dirt at each other, right? Okay, all right. The other thing is just grab it, drop it in, and, and move on through, okay? So we will start with this class, uh, Ms. Sherman's class followed by Ms. Beaver's class, and once Ms. Beaver's class goes through, then we'll come over here to Ms. Miller, and then Ms. Bagley's class over here, okay? Thank <laughs> you. 